Tony Lynn Loveland loves her hometown of Albion, Pennsylvania. She hasn't lived there for years, but when the Albion News newspaper closed, she created a Facebook page for Albion Area News called Smorgasbord News from the Albion Area. She's got more than 2,000 fans of the site. Her latest venture? She wants people in Albion from Saturday, January 3rd at noon to Monday at 5 p.m. to show support for the Albion Police Department. She calls it Turn Albion Blue. She wants people to shine a light, display a candle, or hang a ribbon. After leaving Albion, she moved to Conneaut and then Williamsfield Township. Today, she compiles her Albion news from, would you believe, way down yonder in New Orleans. Yep, like in Louisiana. I've been uh, following the stories on Facebook where different cities and groups have been honoring and recognizing the service from our law enforcement that are going through such turmoil right now. And I decided that my hometown of Albion should get involved. And I posted a status asking if anything, if anyone had anything planned for honoring Albion's law enforcement, and nobody did, so I created an event. I haven't had any trouble with the cops here at all. Okay, <laughs> so, the, so the idea of maybe spotlighting the police and the good they do for a couple of days wouldn't be a bad idea. No. So you're all for that? Huh? Sure. Okay. From 53 hours is how long it will last because every 53 hours we, leave, we lose at least one law enforcement officer in the line of duty. I ask that they display a candle, a light, or place a ribbon at the police station just so the police department knows that they are appreciated, people know they're there, and the sacrifices they give to keep others protected and their, their rights from being violated.